Emily in Paris. We are here in Paris, and you did not come to play with this fashion. No, I did not. You were strategically covered in all the right places. Can you tell me a secret about this dress? Uh, a secret about this dress is I had to have about three people get me into it. <laughs> you have to move breasts, and there, yeah, that was the funnest part. But it's Stefan Roland, and this is the designer that's featured in season three of um, Emily and, ba and Bally. And he is incredible. I actually have worn him before when I presented at the Emmys several years ago. So I was happy to be reunited with him. And I'm wearing his shoes. I'm wearing Bulgari, which is, you know, stunning. never a bad thing. Stunning. So, yeah. Absolutely stunning. Thank you. And you've been such a wonderful addition to this show. Thank you. Just the, the chaotic moments that your character shares with Lily Collins' character. How does the drama this season compare to seasons past? Everything's bigger this season. Oh, and, and, wow. and bigger in terms of uh, more gorgeous locations, more fashion, of course, but also um, they go all, the show goes all through the country this, this year, so you get to see all places in Paris, outside of Paris, but also the storylines, the characters, uh, not just bigger, but they're more, uh, there's more depth, I think, and more expansion, and so everybody has really deep character and relationships, and it's, it's really fun, and comedy. There's a lot of funny. The first three episodes, it's just, it's, you could feel the joy of the writers writing it. It was really, really fun and special. My entire life, I've been practical. I make one romantic decision and it bit me in the ass. Are you talking about work or Gabrielle? Paris. Oh. I can't wait to see what you guys cooked up. I do have to tell you, when you were just talking about your Bulgari jewels, I, I noticed this very stunning oh, yeah. new addition. Yeah. Congratulations. Thank you very much. How is wedding planning going? Uh, we're we're planning and then not planning. We keep going. Uh, let's just enjoy being engaged. It's so hectic. So we've been just so busy with work and planning trips and you know holiday travel. So we're gonna get it done. Yeah. I mean, yes. You're on a show called Emily in Paris. I know. We're in Paris. I saw. Do it here. Honestly, it's the most romantic Honestly, city in the world. I have said. I'm like. I mean, we have to go. We just are obsessed with the architecture here and. We want it to be somewhere beautiful, so maybe, who knows? A little a little fashion inspo maybe from, yeah. from your character? Like are you thinking wedding dresses at all? Yes, I've all yeah, that's a fun bit. It is yeah, fun, you know. Sure. You know, it's fun to fantasize and start looking at designers. I mean that's just fun. It is. And you're like definitely a costume change. For sure. Now it's like you don't it's like it's a given. You get married, there's like three three looks, three, yeah. three yeah, exactly. So I know I gotta let you go. My final question. We love you on Emily in Paris, but you know we're so excited to see you back on Grays. Thank you. How is Addison gonna shake things up in the coming in the coming well, season? We're doing a really strong women's health storyline, um, and Addison's out on the front lines. Um, uh, with um, Bailey and it's really incredible I'm really proud of the work I'm going back on Thursday to shoot another episode oh and then I do another one after the holidays and we have um, some really special guests coming in and it's gonna be it's really cool I'm very proud of the writing and the work so Grey's Emily and a wedding yeah I know busy woman yes I am. I'm so happy to see you thank, thank you, you.